Welcome intro to audiology students. This is your guide to using the Pure Tone audiometer. First you open it by unhooking the clips. And inside is all your cords, your earphones, and all the plugs. First I'll show you how to plug in the audiometer. This is how you plug in the audiometer. Pressing this button right next to the power cord will turn on the audiometer. Right here is the plugs for your bone conduction headphones and the air conduction. Red means right, blue means left. Now your Pure Tone audiometer is powered on. Every button on the Pure Tone audiometer has a different function. This is the stimulus button which presents the Pure Tone stimulus to the patient. This button either increases or decreases the frequency. This button switches the Pure Tone stimulus from the left ear to the right ear. This button switches it from bone conduction to air conduction. And this button is for the insert headphones and for the air headphones. The intensity number is the loudness or the softness of the Pure Tone being presented. This number is the frequency which is presented in hertz. And this is the masking number in decibels. This knob right here changes the intensity. These are your headphones that you use for the Pure Tone audiometer. These ones are used for bone conduction, and these ones are used for air conduction. The blue side is for the left ear, and the red side is for the right ear. This is how you comfortably put the air conduction headphones on a patient. Then you tighten the tops by using your index fingers to push it down. When you're doing a hearing screening with a pure tone audiometer, you want to make sure you're in a quiet room with minimal background noise. You want to sit the patient in front of you but facing slightly away so they can't see what you're doing with the audiometer buttons. First you want to let them know that this is not a hearing test but it instead is a hearing screening. Then you want to put the headphones on them comfortably. You're going to hear this kind of tone. You will hear this kind of tone but at a very quiet level. Please raise your hand when you hear it, even if it's very quiet. From here you put the intensity to 20 decibels and you test it at 1000 hertz frequency, 2000 hertz frequency, and 4000 hertz frequency. These frequencies are suggested by ASHA. After you screen that ear, you're going to press the, the button to switch it to the other ear, and then you're going to return the frequency to 1000 Hz and repeat the screening. Make sure you record your patient's results as directed, but always remember their privacy as regulated by HIPAA's laws. Now it's time to put away your Pure Tone audiometer correctly. Always make sure you turn it off first, then you wrap up the cord around the headphones so it does not tangle. Place them in the audiometer, then you unplug the audiometer, wrap this up too, place it in the audiometer neatly, you close it, Clip it and done. Congratulations, now you know how to use a Pure Tone audiometer. Billy Ray was a preacher's son, and when his daddy would visit, he'd come along. When they gather around and started talking, that's when Billy would take me walking.